and he had drafted the letter. Then uh, someone uh, was told, go pick the letter from the deputy president. So between the, the place this guy was living and the Senate, the people from the deputy president's office refused to pick his letter, uh, to pick his phone call. So the letter was not delivered. Well, I don't know the truth, but I hear he did not, or his team did not pick... Uh, uh, the phone call so they did not hand over the resignation letter so he's in the senate forget about that that is something that uh, someone randomly i was having a conversation with them and um me i'm doing my own political analysis because that is what i've been doing for 16 years you do yours i maintain you do yours if mine is not correct you do yours that is correct so let me tell you why i think these guys are political genius so he decided to play to the gallery and uh, it's gonna go on until the evening but he's still going to be impeached. I don't see the reasons. And I'll tell you why he's still going to be impeached. And one or two, three um, I, I, um, charges that are going to fly. And I think Maximum would before I'll be telling you about them. I've written them somewhere. So let me tell you the political genius of the deputy president. So what's going to happen is this process is going to go to the end. Then the deputy president is going to go to court. Then he's going to tell the court that uh, he has been humiliated all these bad things have happened to him but he does not want to be brought back to the office his intention of going to the court at the final end of this process will not to tell the court that he wants to be the deputy president in fact he'll say he's been humiliated and all these things have happened in our presence we've seen them i mean they're not clean things they're not good things to be that that linen to be washed in public the way it's been washed it's not clean but here is it. He's genius. By telling the court that, he's going to play in their hands. And what is the court going to do? Sympathize with him. Well, this guy just wants this issue of impeachment to be expunged. I think it's Article 75, 3 or something. Um, because I think it's 75, if I'm wrong, 77, 75, somewhere. They are These things are many. Bueno. So, He's going to tell the court, please, I don't want to go back to the office. These guys have done ABC. They have done ABC. All I want is for you to clear my name. And because he has no pending criminal case, the court are going to clear him from this impeachment. Meaning he will run. He's going to go back to his base. Energize it. Get a political party. He's going to compete William Ruto in 2027. Ha, mark my words this will take time to be confirmed like these other ones you're confirming because you're even going to confirm that he's going to be impeached and i want to tell you the reasons he's going to be impeached but have you seen the political genius in the deputy president he let this fly and yende, 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 yende. he's impeached then he's gonna to go to court but his purpose will not be to contest the position of deputy president there's no way they can work with william bruto yeah kuna there's no way they'll work with william bruto so he's going to say all oh, these things but because he has no political uh, he has no criminal case like mike sonko who's a very good friend of mine or babayao the court will discharge him from this impeachment then he can run now that is my word for today because i know that is not going to happen let's see if it plays out the way i have told you that's the political genius of this guy so um i said four charges they only need four out of eleven to to impeach him it might be three it might be four it might be five but i'm banking between uh, uh, three and five only they're not going for the all the 11 so the first one this camps thing is big i mean kenyans um if we want to really fight corruption a whole ceo of camps stands there and says i was intimidated i felt intimidated and we are laughing and busy clapping at his being made by the lawyers i mean are we sincere that we really want to um strengthen our institutions and fight corruption so i think the camps one will nail him if these guys are if these guys are committed to fighting corruption the devolution thing is a big thing. It will, it could nail him. Um, uh, and the reason why, it's collective responsibility uh, in there. Collective responsibility. Can you imagine even you where you work? You sit in a board meeting with uh, the rest of the staff. Then you're done with the board meeting. Then you walk out. And what you decide in the board, one of you just goes out and uh, says a contrary thing. So I think that is going to nail him. Um, Article 6, especially that issue of giving, I mean, receiving gifts, is going to nail him. So me, I'm banking on those three. Oh, and finally, the tribal thing. 
I think it's a big thing for unity. He's a deputy president of the country. He's not a deputy president of Mount Kenya. I think the tribal thing will also um, nail him. So that unity tribal thing uh, will nail him. Kemsa is likely to be confirmed. Uh, devolution and collective responsibility. You Article 6 uh, receiving gifts, let's see. But those are the four I'm banking on. So let's see how it plays out. Um, the Senate concludes uh, today. And he will be impeached.